Hi all and thanks for watching. We've come to the 50th video in my Kingdom Come Deliverance playthrough and in the previous video we were working on the side quest Money for Old Rope and I actually found out that this is the quest that you do in order to get the Spoil Sport achievement. So we're going to continue on with that quest and hopefully we can get this quest completed and get that achievement in doing so. So let's just get started and get in the game. All right, so we're sitting here just outside of the executioner's camp and I'll just pull up the journal here, money for old rope. So the three items that we need to sabotage here are in this camp and I'll just show you within this area here. Now I'm kind of at the edge of the area and I think in order to do this I'm going to have to strip down my gear as you can see it causes a lot of noise. Even your ring causes noise. So we'll just see here. Okay, so that doesn't cause any noise. That 100, 53. Yeah, so you got to basically strip down most of your gear. I'm not really sure why I have this negative here. See player buffs drunkenness. Okay. So I guess we'll just move the horse off so I'm not sitting right in the open here. We'll just set the horse over here. Okay, so let's wait until dusk and then we'll try sneaking into the camp and see if we can find the sword the tongs and the rope that we have to sabotage here. I probably should have grabbed more food. I think I have some in my inventory though. Okay. Let me just grab some food here. Okay, we've got poison for the tongs. And that doesn't give you much nourishment. But it should be enough. No one on the road. So I'm inside a private area now. See anyone? Hear the dog. Oh, it's right, right in front of me. Maybe I can lure it away. I know if you drop meat. You're the dog, it should lure it away. Okay. Maybe. Okay, let me try and drop meat here.
work? Oh, there's someone there. Well, he hasn't noticed me. way. Oh, he's patrolling. There he is. I can sneak up and knock him out. sneak in here and see if we can't find the items we need. We'll have to stay clear of the dog. Maybe I dropped the meat too far away from him. Oh, there's the executioner sword. Okay, so we got that. Nothing else here. someone there. Rope or anything? Tongs? I don't see the rope. Oh, there's a rope. Doesn't say anything. There's a chest there. There's a rope in the corner. Is that it? Oh, excellent sabotage. That should do it. It'll never hold the weight of a grown man. Any tongs? are here. No, nothing here. That dog's right there. Something there. What's that? Sabotage. I can't 
can't see what I'm clicking on. Poison. If he tries to torture anyone with this, the oh. lucky fellow will die quickly. Okay, excellent. Okay, so we've gotten the tongs and we found the rope and I have the sword. So now I have to go dull it. Now I'm just going to ride actually over to the blacksmith rather than fast travel. Yeah. So let's go dull this sword and I'll see if I can't sneak it back into that chest and then we've got everything taken care of. No, oh, I probably should pull up my torch. Do I not have a torch? Oh. No. Yeah. Don't want to get stopped by the guards. use a grinding stone to dull it and then we'll get that put back okay so probably if I angle the blade flat like that Okay, let's do a bit more. Okay. What about now? didn't really do much that time okay so I'll turn the blade in and put more pressure on it Okay, that should work. Okay, let's go put this back in that chest we found it. So, let's see. Yeah, so, just the sword. And hopefully that guy I knocked out won't be up yet. Because that was fairly quick. And luckily we didn't set the dog off, which was kind of nice. Oh, there's someone on the road there. Oh, there's two people on the road. I gotta be quick. Sword. Oh crap. Gone weaker than these, have you? Darn it. 
Uh. <laughs> What's the matter? Come on! Alright. I'll slaughter you. I guess I shouldn't have run in. Kinda sucks. I wouldn't have rushed if I didn't see those two guys on the road. Oh, they seem to have stopped. Hey. There. Couldn't chop the head off a chicken with this. No, I must have left them far enough away that they didn't get back in time. Excellent. Oh, yeah, there he is. Nice. Okay. Succeeded. Tell Herman. Okay, so I'm supposed to go to the executioner. What do I have here? Defense. Blocking. Lost an opponent. 15%. Stamina. Okay, so if I win a clinch, their weapon becomes damaged. Or, blocking. You'll get tired more often. I think I'll go with the blocking one. Okay, and stats. Speech. Okay, I'll go with that one. Not really any that would have been helpful for this situation, but that's okay. Now I'm just going to put on my armor before I head back. And we'll go and speak to the executioner. Okay, so I'll fast travel over to here. Yeah, I should go to the Millers. I'll go here. That way I can grab food. Oh, I don't have a torch going. And I'm fast traveling through town. So I might get... Oh, see, Rete. It just came up that I... Okay. Let's see who this is.
Guards stop me. Um, here. Oh, okay, so I'm up for stealing here. Probably because I was fast traveling through town without a torch and I rode past a guard. So let's go over to a guard. Hey. Hey, you! Don't move a muscle! Enough! Caught you! Now you'll pay for all your crimes. What? So the thief takes us all for fools. I'll show you how we deal with poor innocent knees here. And it's not just the theft you'll answer for. You should have thought twice what? about what you're what? doing. That will land you a fat fine. No, maybe it was because the fellow saw me at the chest in the executioner's camp. Okay, let's see if we can talk our way out of this. Just my luck. Look, I can't tell you anymore. The fate of the whole empire hangs in the balance between King Wenceslas and King Sigismund. High politics, you know? Not a peep to anyone. Well, I thought... That is, I had no idea. That's how it is. Of course you may go. Okay. Now let's take a look here. Tay. Okay, so that takes care of that. So I guess if you're spotted doing a crime and you get away, then that red bag comes up with the money. Okay, so I'm going to eat while I'm here. That's my character nourishment, 87. Okay. Now how long... Alright, so I'll head to the executioner here, and I'll just wait outside until morning, and then I'll talk to him. Let him know that we sabotaged all the stuff that we had to. So there's the house there. And what time is it? Okay, so we gotta wait a few hours here. Yes, eight o'clock should be good. Okay, so hopefully he's awake now. Just put this torch away. And we'll go speak to him. Let's see. Yep, he's inside the building here. Trespassing? Nope.
There he is. About the executions. Is it done? Can I let them get on with the executions now? Yes. Now all we have to do is go and enjoy the show. Okay. So go and watch. Uh, two o'clock tomorrow afternoon. Okay, so we gotta wait a full day. So let's head over to the bathhouse. We'll get ourselves cleaned up. And I guess I'll head to the Miller's. And we'll rest up there. Then go to the execution here. Yeah. So the rope was in the barn in the upper area. You just had to take the ladder up and it was in the upper corner. And then the tongs seemed to have been on the wagon seat and the sword was in that first tent there. You could at least dress decently before showing your face in public. What? I was dressed. I'd like to make use of the bathhouse's services. So what are you interested in? Uh, I'll certainly need a physician to treat my wounds. Then a hot bath and uh, launder in my clothes. I'm sure you'll be extremely satisfied. Good luck then. Okay, so that takes off some of the wait time. Although I'm kind of surprised that she mentioned being indecent because I, I put all my stuff back on. Well, maybe because I came into town with the sword and I hadn't put any clothing on. All I had was my undergarments. Not sure. Let's have a look. Yeah, I, I've got all my equipment on. Hmm. All right, let's head to the Miller's and we'll kill some more time. Maybe I'll talk to you, Teresa. Yeah. got something for you. I know this is your favorite. It is indeed. Thank you. Excellent. Wouldn't you like to take a stroll somewhere? I'd love to. Hmm, time doesn't seem to be passing. Henry. I don't want to complicate things, but how do you think it will be between the two of us? After all that's happened to us both, you're all I have left in my life. But you've got a lot of work for Sir Radzig and... And I'm afraid you'll have to leave me too. Have no fear. I'll never leave you. Wherever my duties might take me, we'll still be together. After all, you're all that's left to me too. And even though everything might change... Henry, 
Will you promise me something? Anything. Promise me you'll take care of yourself. Even if you were to go away for a long time and... meet other girls. If I were to lose you too, I don't know what I'd do. Ah, oh, Teresa. Just promise me. I promise. Thank you. I know it's a hard thing to promise, but... You know, well, we ought to be heading back. I still have work to do. Besides, you don't want to see me crying like a baby here. Definitely not. You'd start me off too. <laughs> right then, let's go. That's strange, the clock's not moving. Home already? <laughs> See you another time then. Okay. So let's rest and save here. And then we'll go to the... Rest as long as I can. Well, that puts me to midnight. Well, that'll have to do. Then we'll head back over to the executioners and wait for the execution. Then after that, I think I'll finish up the video. Now in the next video, what I'll do is look around for some more side quests, but getting this one done and getting the spoil support achievement should be good enough for, for this one. It did seem to take a bit of time actually getting those items and stuff in the camp there. Time is it? It's midnight. Okay. Don't want to get stopped without a torch. Yeah. So we want to go back here to the gallows. And then I guess wait until 2 o'clock tomorrow.
I think the next thing I'll get is that perk for the dogs where if you're using stealth you don't set the dogs off and I'll get that other one for when you're resting in your stationary your energy and health don't go down and then if I have to wait for a long time like this I shouldn't get tired Okay, so it's almost two o'clock here. So I'd say it's one forty-five. Anyone around? Oh, quite a few people. Okay, so it looks like the execution is going to start any second here. Everyone's kind of just waiting. And, yeah, it's almost 2 o'clock. What happens if I wait? Into your hands, Lord, I commend my spirit. In the name of our Lord Jesus Christ, who redeemed me by his precious blood, have mercy on me and lead me to eternal glory. Amen. That was pretty brutal. Although, I guess we did what we had to for Herman. Okay. So, go to Herman for a reward. Alright, let's go back and talk to the executioner here. Man. They had brutal punishment back then. Okay, so let's talk to the executioner and see how we did. What's it say here? Okay. That was something that Rete folk will never forget this execution. Alright, so we did our job.
Did you see that? An utter disgrace. <laughs> it certainly was. The executioner couldn't hold his head high after that. True. The whole crowd was looking forward to it, and right at the start he fucked up the beheading. And then he took the tongs and... <laughs> and the fellow kicked the bucket right away. Jesus, how he gaped. <laughs> and then furious as a rabid dog. Furious, he grabs the last one. <laughs> And he wasn't even able to hang him. <laughs> I'll be forever grateful to you, Hal. You saved my job, and you deserve a reward for it. Thank you. Excellent. So let's see. Spoil sport. Excellent. Okay, so that's the achievement I got. And the game saved. Okay. So I'm actually going to head over to the Millers. And I'm going to save it there. But as you can see, I got the Spoil Sport achievement. And we did manage to take care of the side quest. So that's all good. We even got a visit in with Teresa. So let me just do a bit of fast traveling here. And then I'm just going to end off this video here at the Miller's. As I said, I'll just look around for some more side quests to actually take care of. And in the next video, and then we'll kind of continue on from there. All right, so I saw that he had a book. So let me just sit down here. And I'll quickly check my inventory. Marathon. What's that? Book on Vitality. Oh, okay. That money. I have to put that somewhere. Um. Uh, okay, I better actually store that. Seeing as I'm going to get caught with that. And I don't want to forget that I have it. Sack from Corey. Okay, there. All right, so let's do this again. So I'll quickly check my inventory. All right, so let's learn that. And that one. Maintenance. Okay, so I'll study the rest of that stuff later. But right now I'm just gonna rest and save the game and we'll finish up the video here so hopefully you enjoyed this video and it's it helps you out if you're actually working on this quest or if you want to work on the quest and you're kind of wondering where those items are and such just do what i did with the armor try and take off all your armor so you don't make any noise and that seemed to even help with the dog so it did set the dog off and if there are any questions or comments please leave them in the comment section below otherwise I hope you enjoyed the video thanks a lot for watching take care and I'll talk to you in the next video